the vast world of real estate, understanding the seller is key to discovering the true value of a property. Hello, real estate warriors. Your guide in the property jungle, the real estate sensei, is here. Today, we're embarking on an exciting adventure to uncover the six types of motivated sellers. Fasten your seatbelts because this journey is going to skyrocket your investing game. What is a motivated seller? Let's break it down. A motivated seller is like a player ready to pass the ball. They're looking to sell their property pronto. Why? That's the golden question, and today we're answering it with not one, but six insightful scenarios. Understanding these sellers' motivations is like having the secret code to a treasure chest. Types of motivated sellers. One, empty nesters. Imagine a house echoing with memories but silent in the present. Our first type, the empty nesters, are parents whose kids have grown up and moved out. The house is now too big and the maintenance a chore. They're looking to downsize, simplify life, and perhaps enjoy their golden years with less burden. As savvy investors, we offer them a straightforward deal, an easy exit, turning their bittersweet goodbyes into a hopeful new beginning. Two, tired landlords. Ever dealt with a faucet leak at midnight? Welcome to the life of tired landlords. They've been through the ringer with demanding tenants, endless repairs, and maybe even legal hassles. For them, selling off the property means freedom from constant stress. When we step in with an offer, it's like offering a vacation ticket from Landlord Island. Our approach? Show empathy and present a hassle-free sale. Three, absentee owners. Now let's talk about absentee owners. They own a property but live elsewhere, maybe in a different city or even a country. Managing a property from afar is like trying to fly a kite in a storm. Frustrating, right? These owners often struggle with managing tenants, upkeep, and even feel the financial pinch of a vacant property. Your role as an investor? Offer them a smooth, remote transaction that feels like a breath of fresh air. Four, tax liens. Next up are people grappling with tax liens. Picture the stress of having a legal claim against your property for unpaid taxes. These folks are under pressure, looking for a way out before they lose everything. When you offer to buy their property, you're not just offering cash, you're offering peace of mind. Be the hero who swoops in with a solution that clears their debts and puts money in their pocket. Five, divorces. Divorce is tough, right? When couples split, the jointly owned property often becomes a battleground. They're motivated to sell quickly to divide assets and move on. As investors, our approach should be sensitive yet efficient. Offer a fair deal that helps them close this chapter of their lives with dignity and as little drama as possible. Six, estates. Finally, we have estates. Inheriting a property can be overwhelming, especially if it comes with mortgages, upkeep, or taxes. The inheritors, often grieving, may find the property a heavy burden. As investors, we offer a straightforward process Handling the complexities and providing a fair price, it's about being compassionate and efficient. Engaging with motivated sellers. Engaging with these sellers isn't just about business, it's about understanding and empathy. Ask open-ended questions like, what would an ideal solution look like for you? Or, how can I help make this transition easier for you? This shows you value them and are there to offer tailored solutions, not just a quick deal. There you go the inside scoop on six types of motivated sellers. Remember, in the world of real estate investing, knowledge is your superpower. Smash that like button if you found this video helpful, subscribe for more insider secrets, and share your experiences or questions in the comments. Stay sharp, stay curious, and as always, happy investing.